What's up, everyone? This is a Destroyer229, and welcome back to Let's Play Mother 3. Last time, we continued to explore the Osohe Castle, and we find us a nice dinner party of ghosts. In this episode, we are going to be searching for something we can do to progress. There were two things that we found. One was a wall with air coming out of it, and one that was a candlestick that needed us to swing over. What the? That's the rope snake. It's, he's incredibly popular these days. I'll train him for one rotten eclair. Are you a merchant? Hey there, person. How about a rope snake? He's incredibly popular these days. He makes for a good pet. He can even change into a jump rope or a clothesline at the drop of a hat. He's a very handy, hard-lurking snake. Yes, sirree. What's this? That's beef jerky. Two Rodney Clares for a beef jerky? I think not. I think these last a lifetime, so even if they seem expensive, smart to buy as many as you can. Okay, the rope snake seems actually something very interesting. What's the flower? Oh, that's a fresh mint. One, okay. What about these ghosts? Hmm, what to choose, what to choose? I just can't decide. I really like the rope snake. He's something, there's something charming about him. Like his length and his jaw. Hmm. You know, isn't the rope snake, ah, God, whoa. There's a sign. Okay, well, it seems like I think the rope snake is actually something really interesting. In fact, I'm pretty sure he's in Brawl, too. I think he's Lucas's... Like, grab. So let's see if we can't get a Rotten Eclair from these jokers. Dang. Oh, well. Haha. <laughs> At very least, I'm right by a hot spring. Three, four, one, two, three, four. Haha! -ha! Take that, you stupid ghost. Uh, oh, don't you dare, damn it! Nauseate again. Three, four. Ha ha ha! Damn it, he's still not dead. No, oh, he's dead now. Hooray! Ooh, ha ha! Rotten Eclair, exactly what I needed. Let's see, through this door is the Ghost Bazaar. We trade items for Rotten Eclairs. Okay. Well, I got a Rotten Eclair now. Can I get the Rope Snake? I'll train for one Rotten Eclair. What do you say? You have it yourself a deal. Thanks a bunch. Things like this last a lifetime, so even if they seem expensive, it's smart to buy as many as you can. Yay, I got the Rope Snake. Thanks. It looks like we both profited. Treasure it for the rest of your life. Kiki. <laughs> okay, well... We can trade Rodney Claire's for a fresh mint, and there's a, another ghost who will trade us beef jerky for one of each, so... No, you don't! Aw, oh, damn it. Damn arachnids! You will not catch me, and I will not get into a battle with a suit of armor. Okay, now that we got the rope snake, I wonder if we can actually go up here, because it seems like that's what we needed. Hey, I was right. Looks like this is a job for me. The rope snake can actually talk. Hook me right onto that candlestick. Go ahead, don't worry about me. All right, buddy. Woo! This is an enemy? Yep. The carpet monster blocked the way. Okay. Oh, jeez, this is actually slightly tough. One, two, three, four. Hmm. Great. Three, four. Why can I not get more than three attacks in? Whoa. Ah. Oh, come on. Offense up alpha. This is not going to be good. Come on, Dust. Duster! Get up! Thank you! Do I even have any more... 
I got yogurt. Crap, I don't have any mints. This is not good. Oh, hmm. I'm doing a little growl. Okay, didn't do anything. One, two, three, four. Yes, okay. Glad I got that taken care of before any real harm was done. What the? I know you're rather strong, but the suit of armor inside here is definitely no pushover either. I'm talking incredibly strong here. If you think you're up to a challenge, I'll move out of the way. Regular items, mystical thief tools, use whatever you can to cling clang boom bang that guy into submission. Okay, um, that's nice and all, but I'm gonna go exploring a bit more. What the? Huh? Who the heck was that? And why is there a safe frog right here? I will go ahead and use it. We've gone up two levels since the last time we saved. Okay, what did that person leave? A pendant. Okay. That a key item? Pendant. A pendant dropped by a girl seen inside a Sohei castle. Where'd she go? I get the feeling. Yup, these things are monsters! A rocking ghost. I really should go back. Holy crap! I'm gonna die! One, two, three, four. I'm so gonna die. One, two, three, four. Can we run? Okay. Run! Yeah! What the? A pseudo door. I am so gonna get myself killed. One, two, three. Oh boy, you're gonna make me nauseated. Can I run? Yes. What the? Why could I not go in that door? Barrel man. Run. I don't care for your shenanigans! The hell is going on here? Can I use this? Ah! Whoa, that's creepy. I am Mr. Passion. The music I am playing is Family Matters, second movement. Listen thoroughly. Ah, uh, sure. Listen and marvel to your heart's content. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna be right back. Damn it! Can I go into this other door? No problem. Ah, oh, it's an enemy! Almost got killed by the damn door! Crap, I'm so gonna die. Damn it, I knew it. Well, second game over. Hopefully this just brings me back to the hot springs, though. Because that's just what I wanted to do. Oh, it just put me by the safe frog. Fully healed and everything. Sweet! So it seems to just put me at the last safe frog. Well, that is very, very convenient. Get away from me, get away from me! Damn barrel. Okay, I'm ready to fight you this time. Because I'm not afraid of dying. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All oh, right, that wasn't too bad. You're not that bad. Two. One, two, three, four. Didn't need it that time. Okay, well, he wasn't too bad. Go in here. Mr. Passion. No. This is what artistic know-nothings like you get. Mr. Pa-ha-ha-ha-ha. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, the music's actually changing too, so it's not just... Very 
continue this on. Okay. All right, Mr. Passion. You ready to go? Let's throw down. Wait, was part of the song from the... Our go... Whatever. This is gonna be... Share charge. Okay. Okay, this is what I really need the Hypno Pendulum for. Ah! How dare you hit me with candles. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four. Okay. At least he's not attacking me. Dang! Ah! I didn't expect it to start right away! Ow! That hurt a lot. Madly brandished his baton. Ah! This is not gonna end well. Alright. Jeez, this guy is no pushover, that's for sure. Three, four. Ha ha! 16 hit combo! This guy does not mess around. Dang! Crap. Okay, um. Beef jerky. Okay, you know what? Do do do. I think Scary Mask was the attack down. A mouse. Booga booga booga. Ah, it didn't work. Um. Wall staple. Damn it! Okay, you know what? Screw that. I probably should have healed right there, but oh well. Damn it, he's still not dead! Crap! 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 Didn't want to use the chick bandana! Damn it! Wow, that guy is tough. Jeez, he just completely murdered me. Do I just... Do I start with everything, or... I... Uh, no. The stuff I used is gone. Okay. Well, that's... bad. Hmm. Well, there's nothing much else to do. This is the only way I can go. I mean, the only other thing I could do would be the possibly train, but... Damn barrels! I mean, that's really the only thing I can do. Would be to train. Okay, let me actually... Let's see, so... Let me actually see this. The Siren Beetle might help. A tickle Stick lowers defense. Yeah, the Scary Mask lowers offense. Enemy to tears. Alright, let's try this again. Have you learned to comprehend my art? No. Now I'm angry! Grrrk! Alright, let's try this again. Let's just go with the Scary Mask right away to lower his offense. Damn it! Do any of these work? Siren Beetle. Had no effect. Okay, it seems like the only thing that's gonna work is the Hypno Pendulum. It's the only thing that seems to work, and it does give me a bit of a reprieve. Three, four. Okay, still asleep. Damn it! Three, four. Alright, now we just put him back to sleep. Ha! Ah, he got lost in his own music. Still, this is the only way I can think of that can actually save me. That, and actually getting the 16-hit combos. 
As long as I can just keep getting as much combos as possible, and as long as he stays asleep. Damn it! Too slow on that. Crap. Good. Beef jerky. Don't you dare. Damn it. Alright, we have no pendulum. Using strategery to beat this boss. Three, four. Admittedly, it does wonders to help. Crap. Three, four. Damn it. Okay, I'm going to want to eat something. Crap, this is my last beef jerky. This is not good. This is not good at all. What? It didn't work! All right, I'll just madly bash him. Go down, will you? Try putting him to sleep again. Even more exuberant. Oh, crap. That is not good. At least he's asleep again. Um... You know what? Let's throw the thunder bomb. See how well this does. Ah, that did a fair amount of damage. Um, nut bread? Okay. Damn it! Crap, this isn't good. Why won't this guy go down? Crap. Ooh, just barely lived. Okay. Um. Hypno Pendulum? Please go to sleep. Thank you. God, this is so nerve wracking. Please die. Three, four. WHY WON'T HE DIE?! I'm so screwed. And there we go. Damn it! Jeez! Why won't this guy die? Okay, well, I'm completely out of healing items. So I'm probably just gonna wanna load up my game. And try again. Man! So, you know what? What about here? I know you're rather strong. This is definitely a pushover. Hmm. Okay. I think I'm gonna call it an episode, but I'll definitely just load up my game from here, so that way I at least have all my items. And next time on Let's Play Mother Three. We are going to go inside and face off against this suit of armor. Hopefully, something with it will allow us... Let me... Let's not get into a fight with that enemy. Hopefully, something from that fight will give us an edge against Mr. Passion. So, hopefully, we can beat him and find out more about that mysterious girl. So, until then, everyone, take care.